Charlie, I've lived through the death of a child. And I know that most of the time, nothing helps. Everything just hurts. And you want to be left alone, and you don't want to talk, and I understand that. But it's not going to stop me from just being there for you, okay? To talk or not to talk, to leave you alone or just be close by. I will do whatever it is that you need me to do. Even if you're not sure what it is, okay? Yeah. Uh, why don't you go get ready and I'll... I can lay out your clothes, okay? Okay. throw things at me, whatever makes you feel better. God knows you used to take care of me when I was all drunk and messed up. And now, honey, I want to take care of you because I love you. I love you so damn much. You know, he didn't even trust me to give him a haircut. But I love this lug of a husband of yours. And I'm going to miss him so much. Look, I get it. If I had a dad as great as Clint, and then here comes this son of a psychopath trying to tell you that we're related. That's, that's not what I wanted. It, it's okay. You don't owe me anything. I'm the guy who lied his way into this town and tried to get his hands on your money by scamming you into thinking that you were my sister. I was my daddy's son. No wonder you don't want to deal with me. I just wanted you to know. That's all. I'll take off now. Oh, wait, Rex. I, um, got a letter from him today. What? I got a letter from him today. He wrote me. The bastard's in a jail in Napa. He's being charged with Jared's murder. He shouldn't be able to get in touch. I know. I know. He shouldn't. But he did. And then I barge in here. Gotta love my timing. Hey, you didn't know. Well, I should have. I should have known what you'd be going through today. Rex, I know what it's like to be told that Mitch Lawrence is your biological father. I really wish you didn't have to go through it. Hold on, hold on. I didn't know when I first got back to Lambview if you were Daniela's father or not. I thought maybe I was just obsessing about you and was looking for some excuse to come find you. All I knew was that I was slipping back down that same rabbit hole that I thought I, I had her thought father. my way... Why would you keep that from me? You're not exactly father of the year, pal. I mean, let's see. You gave Jack away when you thought he might be Max Holden's. You tried to murder Margaret Cochran when she was carrying Sam. You pushed Star down a flight of stairs when she was about the same age Daniela is now and pregnant. When I came back because of Ray Montez's case, where did I find you? In jail. In jail, Todd, because you had plotted to kidnap... <laughs> your granddaughter because you were holding Marty's saber captive and you wonder why I didn't tell you that Daniela was your daughter first of all I didn't know second of all I didn't know that I wanted to know that you were her father why would I want Daniela to be related to you Brody put in a call to the warden but he gave him the brush off well go over his head yeah, well, I was just about to put a call into the head of Department Corrections. All right, find out if uh, Lawrence has a higher up in his pocket. They're letting him send out letters. What else are they letting him do? 